I review robot vacuum cleaners for a living, and this is my tip of the day. So I get this question a lot. Do robot vacuum cleaners, when they get close to stairs, do they fall down? Well, no, and thankfully they don't. So robots have a sensor built into them. Now this one actually did pretty good. That was the fall test. It's ready to clean. So here we have the Mova P10 Pro. It's like most modern robots. These sensors right here are called cliff sensors. So when the robot is turned over, and you could even start a robot on this table, whenever it gets to a cliff, I'm not sure exactly how that sensor works, but it tells the robot to turn away. Even this one, this cheap Roomba has cliff sensors. Now some have more than others, but most modern day robots, all the robots that I test have, have what they call cliff sensors. Now don't confuse that with the carpet sensor. This sensor is called the carpet detection sensor. And any robot that has mop pads should have a carpet detection sensor so that it can raise the mop pads and not get your carpet wet. So whenever a sensor approaches, whenever a robot approaches your stairs, that little sensor is going to tell the robot to turn away. I've never had a robot, I've tested hundreds and hundreds of robots, I've never had one fall down my stairs. These little cliff sensors actually work. Now you do have to clean them, I should have led with that. Every 30 hours, these do get pretty dirty and you get a lint-free cloth and you wipe that glass clean. So you do wanna make sure and clean these. Some are easier to clean than others. These are super easy to clean. These are kind of down in there a little bit. So every, you do wanna make sure and clean those or that sensor could get clogged up and then it won't sense that it's next to the stairs and I guess it could fall down. I review robot vacuum cleaners for a living and this is my tip of the day.